Welcome back, guys, to another Witcher. It's been a while, I tell you. It's been like two weeks, something like that, because uh, Christmas, obviously. And uh, since then, I've done a lot of drinking and a lot of eating. So my memory is a little bit hazy now on what's going on in this game. So let's have a look at the um, um, the quest, have a little bit of a uh, memory jog. Yeah, so we were here at the Brickmaker's Village, and we've seen this woman called Vaska, to do with the century here. So... Vasca revealed me the story of the tower. This is the major tower we're trying to unlock here in the swamp. Um, and there was like this big um, sentry dude, this big rock uh, thing. To open it, I must consult the tarot card that illustrates how to defeat the golem. Yes, it's the rock golem, wasn't it? That is the tower's sentry. So I need to discuss this with Kalkstein. So yes, we'll do this. We'll do this. Uh, we need to speak to Kalkstein and show him the tarot card but also this vasca gave us this other quest called the lost lamb it was the boy's disappearance um now she thought it was the um the druids and we went over there we spoke to the the green naked druid and uh it, it turned out not to be them so we have to keep our eye out on this boy now i've had a comment about this quest and they actually failed it and it was during chapter three and it seemed to be like a, maybe a possibly a bug or something but it was during another quest where they had to go into the cave into the um in the swamp area and they they didn't find the boy or they weren't looking for the boy they did this other quest instead when they left the cave this quest here was um uh, was failed so we'll have to remember to do that but we can't do that we can't do this now till uh chapter three anyway so we'll keep this on the back burner but we won't forget it. Now, someone else also said that I need to get on, really, um, with this private investigator uh, quest. Now, the reason being, I was trying to do all the secondary missions in, like, I was worrying that I would go, go to chapter three and then and then lose all the all the secondary missions. But uh, I need to get on with this one, he advised, or she advised, whoever it was, um, because it makes things a bit funky or something. If I start doing all the secondary quests and not the main quests, then things don't quite work out or something so anyway we'll heed his words and i think first of all we'll go back to vizima and uh see this private investigator so the salamanders are holed up somewhere in this city siegfried advised me to contact a private investigator good idea i know monsters but i could use a professional to help me with this investigation so yeah let's pop over there um it's in vizima anyway so uh let's go in. Oh, i'll see you at vizima guys yes we're here detective's house Right, we got oh Raymond Marlowe. We should uh, nick some of this stuff afterwards. Hello, mate. Well, well, well. What do we have here? I'm Geralt of Rivia. A warrior like no other. Your legend precedes you. How can I help? I'm looking for some information. Is this where I'll find it? Good question. I used to work for the lawyers, Kadringer and Fenn. Satisfied? The names mean nothing to me, but I'll assume that's a recommendation. As a professional, you understand information has its price. I'll pay. I'm all ears, White Wolf. Okay. So, um, let's have a little bit of a chit chat. What's it like being a private eye? What's it like being a private eye? Lousy work in a town full of dirt and conspiracies. I spend most of my time spying on nobles and rich burghers who cheat on their wives. You can't imagine what people are capable of. I don't think I care to imagine. I recently followed Morton, commander of Faltest's palace guards. Heard of him? I don't think so. I saw him in the stables with two young pages. You wouldn't believe. I've heard enough. I'm all ears, White Wolf. All right, let's get to the, uh, get to the point. I'm interested in the people who wear salamander pins. Just so happens I know a thing or two. Before I go on, I wouldn't mind knowing what your interest in the case is. Um... Azar Javed, we say about that? Azar Javed. Name mean anything to you? I've heard it. Why are you looking for Javed? Let's just say my boots do a rendezvous with his ass. Usually I charge for information, but I'll give you this bit for free. Oh, thank you. I've been working on that case for a while. Okay. Go on. Azar Javed, a Zerikanian sorcerer, leads Salamandra. He's more dangerous than a pit of kickimores, but unfortunately out of my reach. With his contacts and resources, he's got almost free reign in the city. I got a taste of his abilities. Anything else? 
I suspect Salamandra has built a large-scale operation, with gold simply greasing the wheels of their political ambitions. They're conducting genetic experiments, dangerous ones. Regular thugs wouldn't have the knowledge or means. Who's working for Javed? Any guesses? The captain of the guard who dropped that investigation disappears, Knights. Maybe you can squeeze some information out of him. Is that all? We might have one more lead. The city guards detained someone who could provide information. The okay. guards at the city jail? Yeah. Find a way to question that prisoner. In the meantime, learn what you can from the guards. Count on it. People open up to me all the time. <laughs> His information could be priceless. Good luck. Okay, um... Okay, let's ask him about the prisoner. Know anything more about the Salamander prisoner? He may be one of the leaders. Though in this town, the guards capture pawns while the big fish swim free. We'll know for certain once you question him. We'll see. Uh, just one thing. I think you're being followed. How would you know Any that? suggestions? Wait here a while. Make them nervous. Surprise those who want to surprise you. I'll leave at midnight. Right, okay. Looks like we are waiting. He had a massacre size of that fish on, on his table as well. The Witcher is taking his time. He must have left a different way. No matter. Seems true. I assume the trap is set. Indeed. Tend to your tasks in the trade quarter. I'll leave the matter to our best agent. Hmm. Oh, we are fighting here. Hang on. What was the uh, keys again? It's been that, it has been that long. It's, it's crazy how much you can actually forget. And it's probably the amount of alcohol I've had as well, which has made my... Uh, this hasn't helped. We're innocent, yes. I know you are. But well, this guy's not going down. Oh, it's an assassin. He's not part of the Salamandra crew. Have I got the right blade? Have I got the, uh... Yeah, steel sword. Right, okay, we finally got him. Sorry about that, poor man. Right, I can pick up this lot there. And what's it say on the journal now? Any updates? So yeah, so it seems that the Salamanders have a secret agent who set a trap for me. I must find out who he is. First, I should interrogate the prisoner being held by the city guards. Um, and this one has now been updated as well. Um, so Raymond, the investigator dude, told me uh, that the city guards caught a member of the Salamanders. I need to get to him and learn as much as I can about the Salamander. I should ask Jethro, the prison guard, where he, he is held. All right, okay, let's do that then. Let's go to Jethro um, after I picked up all this stuff. All right, we're back in the dungeon now. Let's go speak to Jethro, our old drug dealer or drug addict. <laughs> Still on it, I see. I have questions. Ask. Know anything about this salamander prisoner? Why would I tell you? <laughs> the captain would kill me. Maybe I can persuade you. Powder would help. Oh, yeah, I thought it might do. Okay, let's give him a bit of... Um, Fizz tech. No, what was it called? Fizz, fizz tech. Yeah. I never turn down good <laughs> fizz tech. All right. Tell me about that salamander prisoner. But <laughs> I hardly know anything. Where is he? They took him to Lebiota Hospital. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. See ya. So, Libio the hospital we haven't actually been to yet. Uh, let's have a quick update on the mission status or the quest status. Um, so, yeah, I ret in return for some fist tech, Jethro told me the guards transported the prisoner to St. Libiota's hospital. I might be able to speak with him there. Okay, let's do that then. I don't know if there's anything else been updated, does it? Oh, it has. What's this? Oh, yeah. That was that was one of the quests we got from um, the Druids. I agreed to take the uh, Yavin's letter to Vivaldi. His friend in Vizima. Uh, Yavin trusted me. After all, I could tell the authorities, for example, the guard captain about Vivaldi's dealings with the squirrels. All right, so forget about that one. So let's go to the, um, where was it? The hospital. Let's track it on the map. Okay. So it'll be the first time we've been there, actually. I have purposely avoided certain areas because I just feel a bit, sometimes I just feel it's a little bit overwhelming. 
with all the quests we have. Anyway, guys. Oh, it's only around this corner. It's only here, which is good. Right. Where is it around here? Oh, yeah, here we are. There we are. Oh, is that Zoltan? Yeah, hello, Zoltan. <laughs> I wonder if we can speak to him again. Right. Uh, City Guard, should we speak to you first? No passage. I'm going inside. Now you tell Disease him. Disease patients inside. I'll not have you spreading the pestilence. Wow. I had to show my ring. Fine, move on, he said, but he didn't say. Sent Leviodas Hospital. Right. This is nice. Looks like it's a church more than a hospital. Yeah, all these sick people. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't want to die. No, I'm not surprised, really. I wouldn't want to die. But I think you are going to die. Um, Altar of Militali. 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 Which is the temple, isn't it? Where... We do anything with it? Use object. Oh, can we give it something? Oh, I haven't got anything. Oh, I've got some... I can give you a sugar doll. What's that give me? Oh, we got some mistletoe. Very nice. All right, let's go, let's go and find this prisoner then. Can we talk to any... Can we talk to the nurse? I want to party. I'm sick of the dying. She wants to party. Okay. <laughs> let's go a quick look at uh, word of this. Oh. Novice nun. Have you come to pray to the Great Mother? I'm not very religious. Melitele loves even those who go astray. That's kind of her. How can I help? Well, tell me more about this Melitele. Tell me more about your goddess. Melitele is mother of all living things. The goddess of love, fertility, and healing. Why does the statue represent three figures? The goddess has three faces, symbolizing her different aspects. What are those? A young, carefree girl, a mature, pregnant woman, and a hunched old woman. Oh, okay. I see. How can I help? Um, I seek something and find a clue I can't... I seek something and found a clue I can't understand. It is while you came. The goddess is infinitely wise. The clue says... Well, read it yourself. Three faces. That's Melitele. Behold the statue with the goddess's three faces. And the sacrifice? Only nature's harvest. Fruit, plants, flowers. Oh. Melitele dislikes killing done in her name. Oh, so yeah. So we just got to give her food and stuff. Flowers and that. All right, fair enough. Um, anything around here? A trunk. Oh, um, I should pick that up. I'll have a little read of that. All right, well, let's, let's get going. There's nothing else in here, is there? Not worth reading. Okay. Uh, prisoner. I saw some guards down here just now. Right, here we are. You're sleepy, are you? Right, can I have a word, mate? Stay away from the prisoner. Um, give him some money then, yes. Ten orans. Stay away from the prisoner. Yeah, you said I that already. Ask some <laughs> questions. Not now. Come back at night. But I paid you. Why at night? But I paid you. Shh. Return tonight. Very odd. Right, it's now night time, which is really random. Oh, where's one? Oh, he's here. Yeah, it's now night time. So let's see if he lets us talk to the prisoner now. Stay away from the prisoner. But, but I paid, I paid you. you. Shh, he's talking. Kalkstein. Oh. He, he's passed out. Shove off. There's a commotion in the corridor. Bloody thugs. Ramsmeat sent them. Ramsmeat? What? No. Oh, there is actually thugs. I thought he was just... I never heard him come in at all. Well, let's fight these dudes then. Let's give, let's give these guys a hand. Let's get Ramsmeat thug. Level gained as well. I like it. Right, let's just get finish off these dudes. Oi! Eat dirt, yes. Oh, oh you bastard! <laughs> it's not a bad game, this. It's quite good, really. These are sort of games I could just sink into for hours and hours on end. 
Um, right, okay. Let's just see what the uh, quest update actually says now. Um, so the prisoner was in hopeless condition. All he managed to do was whisper the name of Kalkstein. We couldn't proceed with the conversation as Rams Meets Thugs raided the hospital. The name of Kalkstein is is, uh, is some lead. I wonder what Raymond is going to say about that then, eh? Um, so yeah, let's go back to speak to um, Raymond. Is there anything else updated? Right, we've got two things there. Cal uh, suspect, Kalkstein. So there are certain clues indicating that Kalkstein, the alchemist, is somehow connected to Azar Javid. Uh, I shall talk to the alchemist. Maybe I'll find out more about it. So... Yeah, we should question him. And then Ramsmeat. Uh, so the evidence indicates there's some sort of connection between Ramsmeat and Azar Javid. I will talk to the bandit and try to learn more. So we've got two leads here. Um, and then these leads here. So I decided to give Thayla the benefit of the doubt. So these two were like we said they, they were like not um, guilty for now. But we have two more suspects. So I think for now, let's go back to um, uh, Raymond, the, the uh, detective and uh, see what he says all right he's still up and he's still eating that fish <laughs> it's a big whopper of a fish that i'm all ears white wolf okay so um oh so i captain sorry i questioned the captain of the city guard so i questioned the captain of the city guard any conclusions i think he's innocent surprising sure he didn't pull the wool over your eyes i might have don't done. worry about my eyesight it's not Vincent. Okay, he seems very, All right, very I'll sure of that. him off our list of suspects. For, for now. now. He's hiding something, that's clear. But I'll look into that later. What about our other leads? Well, um, so yes. So, I got to the prisoner. He spill anything? Didn't have time. Ramsmeet's men attacked. You sure? Strange. Ramsmeet wants Salamandra gone. Unless something I don't know about has occurred. Javed might have scared him. Or paid him off. Something to check. Did you get anything out of the prisoner? One word. Kalkstein. Makes sense. Kalkstein's known to be a talented alchemist. He could be helping Jarved with his experiments. I've met Kalkstein. He didn't look the criminal. That might be true, but we need to check all our leads. Let's get to work. I'll ask around town, talk to my contacts. You keep an eye on Kalkstein. Gain his trust. Get to know his plans and secrets. How do you want to proceed? Patience. This is just like fishing. I prefer hunting. Then gain Kalkstein's trust. Do him a favor. Learn something that interests him. You could get him to hire you. And talk to Ramsmeat, but don't overdo it. There's one with a short temper. Right, don't overdo it. We'll remember that one then. Um, so quest completed, the Crown Witness. We have two sense. leads now. Uh, Kalkstein and... Um, Rams meat. Okay, let's look at look. My God, look at all these blinking side quests we got. Absolutely loads of them. Um, so yeah, there's nothing else really. So let's just talk to um Calc. Let's, it's time to talk to Raymond about Calcstein. Calcstein, trust me already. All right. Can we talk to you again then? I'm all ears, White Wolf. How do you want to proceed? Patience. I prefer it's all the same. Gain Kalkstein and talk. Right, it's all the same stuff. So I think we need to speak to Kalkstein, really. So let's do that. And um, we need to see Kalkstein as well about other things. We, we got that um, tarot card as well. So yeah, let's um, let's around the corner. Let's go and and see Kalkstein. God, this game feels so massive. It's a big old game, isn't it? Because then my plan was to play this game and then play. The, Witcher 2 and then Witcher 3. I think I'm going to be doing this till 2024 or something. Right, um, here we go. I can't see it being Kalkstein because he seems to be involved in too many like missions or quests. Oh, he is in best. Wake him up. Hmm. Sorry, I got lost in thought. Oh, you were asleep. Um, let's talk about the tower first of all. This is to do with the tarot cards in the century. The tower. Yes? Vasca helped me locate the tower tarot card. It describes how to wake the sentry. Let's see this card. Interesting. Much depends on interpretation, but I think I understand. Alchemists find it easier to understand other alchemists. Enlighten me. The sentry can only be woken if it's near the tower, which it is, and by using a lightning rod. Yes. A lightning rod? 
The drawing depicts a man in a crown. A reference to King Herman the Mad? Okay, who's this guy then? Who's Herman the Mad? Herman used to ascend a tower during storms and insult the guards. A hostile faction carried out a coup by removing the lightning rod from the tower. An interesting story. You'll need a device that attracts and conducts lightning. Put plainly, a solid metal rod. A good smith should be able to forge one for a decent price. What okay. next? Yes, we'll need a thunderstorm, but I have no idea how to make Mother Nature cooperate. I'll think of something. When you have everything, attach the lightning rod to the sentry. Energy from the lightning bolt will revive the golem. What next? No idea, but you'll manage. If you kill the golem, you'll be able to make a rare potion requiring his heart. Here's the formula. That we'll nice see. one. Right, so the sentry now has been updated. So to wake the golem up, I have to arrange a lightning storm and get a lightning rod. Piece of cake. First, I should find a craftsman. Uh, storm without the lightning rod is a little use to me anyway. So yeah, we need to get that. I don't know how much it's going to cost us. Um, so anyway, let's go talk to him about something else. Let's talk about Salamandra. Hmm. I think you're in league with them. What? Me? Why? That's what I'd like to know. What is it you're after? Something I, I don't have evidence for yet. Evidence indicates you're linked to your organization. Hmm. And we haven't actually got any physical evidence, just a name. Evidence indicates you're linked to the organization. What evidence? The wounded salamander mentioned you. That's likely since I hired him. What for? To help with my experiments. I had no idea he belonged to a secret organization. I suppose he distilled the fifth essence and dusted the philosopher's stone? He protected me from Salamandra and did other tasks. He risked his life for me and your sarcasm will not change that. Get out of my sight, mutant. I think we probably believe him, to be fair. Because he came quite clean. Because, yeah, I did. I hired him. Um... So yes. I believe you. I don't know enough to decide. Let's drop the subject for now. Right. We can't waste time. When you find that criminal, I'll gladly help. But now, back to work. All right. So we could go and speak to um, Ramsmeat. So I'll reopen really the case when I find new evidence. Okay. So for now, um, where was Ramsmeat? Is that the dude in the Hairy Bear Inn? Okay. We are in the Hairy Bear Inn. Is this fella here? Here he is. Here he is. What do you want, Wolf? Ever seen the salamandra sign? I've seen a lot. Have a problem with that? Um, best tell me all you know. The name is Arm. Um, oh. We were advised not to go a bit deep on him. So I just say no problem. No problem. Anything else? Well, I think I'm going to have to ask him, aren't I? You might want to kick our ass though for what it. What do you want, Wolf? Right. Ever seen the sun? I've seen... Right, okay. Let's go for it. Best tell me all you know. The name Azar mean anything? You might kick, kick her ass now. Before I slit someone's Here we throat, go. I give them some advice. Never threaten me. Make sure you remember that. I mean, image is everything. Right? I need to talk to you about Salamandra. Okay, I'll be back. I'll be back. Spoken like a true Terminator. Right, um... I think we might have to speak back to the, uh... uh to Raymond then, I guess, and see what he says. Oh, hello, what's happened? Okay. Very dark. Christ almighty. Right, I should have had a cat potion on or something. Oh, we better get out of here because um, we are getting attacked from behind. Oh, Christ almighty. Is it just him left? Yes. Oh, we need a loss. We, need, we could have died then. Thanks, Gerald. You saved my life. The bastard snuck in here. Somehow they found out I'm after them. Who? What happened? Salamandra. 
I was a step away from solving the mystery. One small step. Relax, Raymond. You're safe now. Not likely. They're following me day and night. I gotta find a way to lose them. What do we do? I'll set a false trail. You question the new suspects. Who? Here, take these notes. They list all the key leads. What do you intend to do? They're on my heels, so I've got to disappear. I'll draw them away while you pursue the investigation. I'll find you, White Wolf. See, I wonder if it's something to do with the city guard, because he was, you know, we want to um, question that witness in the hospital. And he was like, come back at night time. So I reckon it's got something to do with the guard somewhere. Anyway, um, let's have a look at the letter. So, list of suspects. We got Vivaldi, Levarden, Vincent, Thaler, Ramsmeet, and Kalkstein. Right. So the new one here now, we got Levarden. This is still, it still says I've got, got to speak to this Ramsmeet about his dealings with Azar. So maybe we have to pressurize him a little bit more. But I think for now, let's go and speak to Declan Levarden. He's that big, big dude at the dike. Um, yeah, so I'll... Um, I'll see you guys there, I guess, yes. Mr. Marlowe sent me. What's happening? Raymond said he has some new information. Come to his house as soon as you can. Thanks oh. for the message. <laughs> that was quick. My legs hurt. Do they, mate? Um, Vizima Confidential. I must meet up with Raymond again already. That's crazy. I went really quick. So yeah, Raymond sent some messenger. He wants to meet me as he gains some new information. I wonder how he will react to my discoveries. We haven't even spoken to uh, Declan yet, Levarden, so... All right, well, let's go and see him then. Oh, in fact, <laughs> he's back in here. I thought he left. So, yeah, I'll speak to him. Okay, Raymond. Maybe he didn't leave. Maybe, maybe he just went to bed. My, my wolf thing's going crazy, look. Welcome. You won't believe what happened. Tell me. Not so fast. Remember, I have expenses. I don't know what money How we need to go. Owe you? 200 orans. Okay. This investigation is getting expensive. I'm not the Prophet Labiota. I can't live on roots and berries. Neither can my informers. I guarantee you these are the bare necessities. Okay. All right. 200 orans. Down to business. We probably could have gotten down. transferred the prisoner after the attack. Not good. Especially since we won't get anything else out of him. He died last night. How did that happen? Well, he wasn't in great shape, so I guess it's no surprise. But I have a feeling. Someone helped him along? Exactly. Shani is a good friend of yours, right? Ask her to do an autopsy. Once we know the cause of death. Wait a minute. Are you spying on me? That's my job. See you later. Right, yeah, see you later, alligator. Um, so, okay, let's have a look at <laughs> quest update again. I have never done an autopsy before. Well, there always has to be the first time for everything. I have to make an appointment with Shani and get the corpse from the grave digger. All right, let's do that then. I thought, I think as well, we have to see Shani about something else. It's probably one of these vast amount of quests I've got to do. Uh, but let's concentrate on this one for now anyway. It makes it, it makes it nicer then, just to keep it all wrapped up in like one episode one sort of quest line rather than darting around doing all secondary quests and that but anyway let's go back to the uh lebioda lebioda hospital it's funny she wasn't in here before was she but she's somewhere now she probably she probably around here actually no shiny are you in here i'm so tired are you go to bed then <laughs> it's really late um, should we ask him? Some... daily to give me strength. Yeah. Right. I don't know where Shani is. Right. She's not here. So we're going to have a little sweep around, guys. I'll see you in a second. Maybe she's in the wardrobe. <laughs> right. I'll tell you what. I'm going to come back in the daytime. Uh, she's probably a daytime worker. Or I could go. I could go to her house, really. But what I'll do, I'm going to go wait till daytime, which I think is probably nearly there anyway. What time is it? Uh, Two thirty in the morning. So. Let's, let's meditate, and I will see you guys in a bit. Right, I couldn't find Shani in the uh, the hospital, so I'm going to try her house. Maybe it's a little bit too early for her. She's probably still sleeping. 
got that old deer as well, don't we now? Hello. Oh God's sake. <laughs> Hello, precious. Do you All right, go lovely. upstairs? Yes, thank you. Right. Let's go upstairs then. And hopefully she's up here. No, she is up here. Gerald, we need to talk. I know we what do. Some people died in a fight at the hospital. Were you involved? Explain mm. yourself. I wanted to question a prisoner, one of your patients, but thugs interrupted us. It was their bodies the guard discovered later. Hmm. Anyway, the prisoner is being transported to a safe location. Thanks, Shani. Just watching out for you. Thank you very much. Shani, I wanted to ask you something. Mm-hmm. I need your help with an autopsy. Uh -huh. An autopsy? Since when do you deal with stuff like that? Since I started investigating Salamandra. Okay, though, I'm no coroner. You'll have to interpret our findings. We'll meet in the evening. Until then, gather as many clues as possible. I'll sniff around. Get the body from the grave digger. We'll meet at the hospital in the evening. What's, what's all this she's doing? Um, how do I find information to help the autopsy? Well, the grave digger. How do digger. I find information to help the autopsy? Ask Vincent Mice, oh. but also look for books on anatomy and pathology. Farewell. Really? I've got to look for books. Okay, so... Okay, we got to read books again. So, what's it say on our update? I'll collect the corpse from the grave digger. Um, it should take some time. So, in the meantime, I'll prepare for the autopsy. I should talk to people who have conducted investigations or read some books. Or read some books, I say. Uh, so, while I'm waiting for the corpse, I should talk to some... Right, so let's... um. I guess go to the go to the grave digger then yeah okay let's go there then um and we need to speak to that vincent mice as well about the plants we killed in the swamp i believe well there's vincent mice here let's talk to him first because we got that um plant what is it witcher okay i killed this archer spore in a swamp i killed the archer spore in the swamp i have proof what the hell is this huh the hideous things that run. 400, nice. That's 400 Oren's reward. Okay, um. Let's, do you ever. Yeah, do autopsies? You ever do autopsies? What for? Punctured stomachs mean gang warfare. Torn off heads mean beasts. And black tongues mean poison. The first case, we pressure Ram's meat. The second, we pass on to the Order or a Witcher. The third, we go to the victim's wife. The culprit 90% of the time. Autopsies are a waste of time. Okay. Okay, we quest that. We did that secondary quest, and that's taken off our long list. Um, there was other what things we could Richard? ask him as well. Okay. Oh, no, no. We don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. We want to stay on the Druid side, don't we? I nearly clicked it then. Um, okay. I have a letter signed by Yevon, leader of the bandit squad. Might be now. Okay, forget that one. Many problems in town. Bandits, monsters, the plague, and you. <laughs> right. What is it, Witcher? Nothing. Right. Yeah. So this one here, we, we won't do that one. I want to see you. Keep. I think I want to keep on side with those druids or that guy. Right. So we need to go, go to the grave digger. I went wrong direction, basically. That's why I ended up here first. But yes, yeah, so I'll see you at the grave digger if I can find it. Well, this place is like a maze. It's not that big, but I... <laughs> anyway, here we are. Grape digger. What do you need? Um... Uh, okay. A prisoner died recently. Is he in the cemetery already? Don't know. You can have another body. They all reek the same. I'm after a specific corpse. Particular. Come back when you know what you want. Examining remains is an art. Always worthwhile to look deeper, but who does that concern? Could you hand over the prisoner's body for an autopsy? For a bottle of dwarven liquor. I don't think we've got any dwarven liquor, have we? No, we haven't. Right, okay. Well, I'm going to go and get some dwarven liquor then, and I'll be back in a second. All right, okay. So I've been everywhere looking for bloody dwarven liquor um i couldn't find anything so dwarven liquor i, I basically got other things as, instead um so i don't know if yeah i couldn't find it so I, it's, it's not gonna be beer or lager or wine so i wonder if this this will work cherry cordial Kidding. 
Obviously not. All right, well, I'm going to just try some different things then, guys. What have I got? Some mead. For God's sake. Nothing like a good drink. Okay, that's good. I don't know what that was. About the prisoner. Where you want the body dumped? At the hospital. It'll be there by evening. Farewell. So now we can wait. He's pissed now. <laughs> Quest updated anatomy of a crime. I have to come to the hospital at midnight. All right, okay. The only other thing now is... Do I need some of these books on anatomy? Or should I just go in there and just blag it? <laughs> I might wait till midnight. I can't. I don't know where to get the books from. Um, I don't know. Where, where can I get books from? I'm going to try the merchant. I'm going to pop over to see the merchant and just see if he's got some books on on uh, anatomy, anatomy. Anatomy? Anatomy? Right, I've just gone to this... Um, is, it, is it the antiqua antiquarian guy? Whatever his name. The dwarf. And he sells all these books. And I've come across this one here. Forensic Medicine. This is exactly what we want. Uh, so yeah, let's buy that. And hopefully, that will aid us. It, oh, what's this? Well, is there anything else here we could use? I think that's probably enough. Okay, well. Let's read this book then. Thank you very much. And hopefully, it will help us. Okay, it's a big one here. But I'll quickly read it. And give you the uh, the summary. Okay, it's basically obvious stuff, really. We just read it and uh, we just spent 150 gold or Oren. And I uh, might send it back to him. But basically it just says that we should question witnesses and that. Um, but yeah. I think well, what I'll do, we'll just wait till midnight. And go to the uh, the hospital and see Shani. What I might do, first of all, before waiting till midnight, is go and question Levarden And maybe talk to Ramsmeat again. Um, so let's go and have another, another pop at Ramsmeat. Because he might give us some information, or one of them might give us if, uh, some information about this uh, autopsy. Um, yeah, so let's do that. He, this guy might kick us in the ass, but... Oh, he's not even here. Right, forget that then. Uh, let's go to Levarden instead. Here he is. Yes? Big man himself. Okay, um... I've nearly completed my investigation. All right, speak. If you don't work with Salamandra, who are you? If you don't work with Salamandra, who are you? A modest merchant. Allow me to show gratitude with a gift. Quit bluffing, Declan. This symbol signifies my secret society. We seek to destroy Salamandra. Learn anything useful? The Salamanders have risked much. This is a political matter, let me tell you. Some larger schemes at play in Redania. Few people know this secret. King Faltest, the Lodge of Sorceresses, and I watch the northern border. How does this relate to Salamandra? Azar Javed has sent a special force north. My men saw them. He too knows something's brewing and is making preparations. Okay. Quest completed. Suspect Levarden. Okay. New quest. What lies beneath? I reckon I should search for leads on my own. Okay. Well, let's just go back to Ram's Meat then. I think we have to wait till night time to go back into the, to the inn. The hairy bear inn. So... Um, we'll have another pop at him, and then we'll just go to the hospital and inspect the body. Right, Ramsmeat is not here, so... Yoo-hoo! So I think instead... He's not around here lurking, is he hiding? No, I think we go to the hospital Fighting now. Yeah. Alright, let's go to the hospital. I'm just saying that, he could be in there. Ramsmeat's house. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Looks like I have to deal with these idiots. Are you lost? Who lives here? Don't answer a question with a question. Let me rephrase. Some nerve. This is Ramsmeat's house, and he never spoke of a visiting mutant, so scram. Um... Looking for something? Let's give him some tweet out, okay. Alright, go in. Well, that was easy enough, wasn't it? Like you say, this might not be the best choice, though, speaking to him. What do you want, Wolf? I need to talk to you about Salamandra. Quickly. When I ask about Salamandra, your henchmen get shifty. They're like me. We don't like Salamandra. 
And I'm a priestess of Melitelli. And I'm a priestess of Melitelli. You are either very brave or very foolish to accuse me. Neither, Ramsmeat. You should have asked my men why they get nervous. Now shove off. Your people attacked me at the hospital. You cracked? I sent them there to bring back one of ours. Why don't I believe you? Let's say I believe you. Why don't I believe you? I don't give a red ass. In that case, let's call it a misunderstanding. Sorry about your boys. Pity. Life's a bitch, then you die. Now, if you shove off, I got some deals to tend to. I'm short on proof, so let's say I leave you alone for now. Thanks a lot, but you'll allow me not to fall at your feet. If you do happen to find Javed, I'll be glad to hear about it. And if you find any of his underlings, I wouldn't mind having a chat with them, too. Right, okay. Um, quest updated, suspect, suspect Rams meet. So that will be reopened when... Um, when we get some more info. So let's go to the hospital now. All right, and we are out to the hospital. Uh, let's take a look out for Shani. Oh, she's up there somewhere, right. Hopefully with the body there, ready and waiting for us. Hello, Sean. Ready for the autopsy? Not Let's really. Get started. Right. God, look at that ribs and all. Okay, Sean, what are you doing? I thought you were supposed to be doing the autopsy. What's she doing? Doing some herb, um, alchemy stuff. Race, human. Gender, male. Wounds, extensive. Shani, this isn't a lecture hall. Whatever you say. He died yesterday, torn to pieces. A werewolf. Could a human have inflicted these wounds? The bone marrow has been sucked out. Okay. We need to, um... We need to be controlling this then to say what we think it might be. Could a human have inflicted Maybe. these wounds? Only with a two-foot jaw. Two-foot jaw? Could it be the werewolf then? A werewolf? The moon's shining. Wouldn't he turn into a lycanthrope? I guess. Geralt, no need to test me. I'm a professional. Moving on. Right, so it's not a... It's not a werewolf then. Maybe we didn't read as much stuff as we should have done. Uh, the bone marrow has been sucked out. The bone marrow has been sucked out. Must be scavengers. Very likely. Plenty around the cemetery. So, he was torn to pieces after he died. I'm interested in the cause of death. I also see some stab wounds. A blade two fingers wide. A blade two fingers wide. An assassin's dagger. Um, something's wrong. His head is in an unnatural position. His hands twisted. External signs aren't everything. His neck, muscles and palms look tense. How do you know when he died? Okay, I reckon one of these two, possibly. Or it could be Rams meets men. External signs aren't everything. His neck muscles and palms look tense. How do you know when he died? Normally I base it on muscle stiffness and dehydration, but rigor mortis is persisting for too long. They say successful autopsies are based on curiosity. Should we look? Let's check his internal organs. Internal organs. Now, I think it's a strigger, the one that he fought right at the start of this whole game. Um, go for the liver. The symptoms are peculiar, and the cause of death, too. Those wounds are too obvious. I suspect something more. Poison? If so, a rare sort. Perhaps an alchemist's brew. Kolkstein? Ah! Liver's completely cirrhotic. It was obviously a potent poison. This stinks of alchemy. Really? Any way to confirm that? Any way to confirm that? Yes, alchemist's poisons usually cause certain characteristic changes. Then let's check for those. It was Calc dying all along then, possibly. Look, the tongue was crudely extracted, but not all the blackened tissue was removed. Blackened? 
Yes, the poison caused necrosis of the tongue, so the murderer removed it. So we're certain a gifted alchemist is the murderer. A gifted alchemist who's a crappy surgeon. Kalkstein. He wanted to implicate the bandits, but he failed to foresee a professional autopsy. Oh, I see. Thanks, Shani. That's the evidence I needed. Good. I'm exhausted. So he wanted to make out that it was rams meets bandits or assassins, did he? The autopsy proved Kalkstein was the murderer. Um, quest updated suspect Kalkstein. Kalkstein is guilty and need to pressure him. Oh my goodness me. Shani was very helpful. I should visit her one day. So quest update on that. And then um, time to go to Raymond's house. God, we've got loads of stuff to do. Um, so we should, what should we do first? And I'll tell Ramsmeet I found proof of his innocence. Well, maybe we're going to Ramsmeet first. We did just leave his house and we were like throwing out accusations at him, weren't we? So um, let's go to Ramsmeet first. Yeah, let's go there first. I'll see you guys at uh, Ramsmeet's abode. But the buffoons at the door wanted 20 more Oren just to get back in here again. Anyway, Ram's meat. I've got some good news for you, my son. What do you want, Wolf? Okay, want the truth about Salamandra? Okay. Want the truth about Salamandra? I'm listening. Someone wanted me to believe you led Salamandra. Someone wanted me to believe you led Salamandra. And I thought Salamandra sent you. Hmm. That's interesting. They really liked me out of the saddle. They tried to poison me and sent several masked assholes out to assassinate me. But that's all too little for Uncle Ramsmy. I thought you were their next attempt. I know you're fighting Salamandra. I'm hunting them too. Javed wants to take over my business. He decided to start with the girls. Know why? Though he left Zerakini a long ago and trained to be a mage, deep inside, he's remained a fucked up wild man. Now you get it? Not really. He's driven by instinct. Things with that Zerakanian cock of his. And he's got some strange fetishes. Likes fire. My girls are scared shitless. And they don't scare dead easily. Thanks. That helped. No problem. All right. See you. Okay, um, that's wrapped up. We're up now. New entry in journal. Let's have a quick read what's going on with these characters. So with Azar Javid, a little update of his character. Women are another weakness of this wizard. And his lust is equal to his appetite for magical power. So he loves, he loves women. <laughs> well, don't we all? Well, maybe not all of us. Some of us. Some of us like him. Some of us don't. So this Kalkstein has dealings with Vizima's criminal underworld. Strange company for an alchemist to keep. Uh, even though he calls himself a scientist, Kalkstein is an alchemist. So he's definitely dabbles in magic. So the old friend of mine with, with Shani. So the autopsy is finished with Shani's aid. The poor thing. She's very tired. Uh, she should rest. So I reckon there is something else she wants of me. Maybe I should talk to her later on. When she finishes her work. So we'll do that. Um, and then Kalkstein. Kalkstein is in collusion with Azar. I'm now convinced I need to confront this guy. So let's go and see him next. I'm not sure what that one is there. Oh yeah, we've still got to do that one. Right. Um, let's go to Kalkstein then. And I think, is this updated as well? Oh yeah, we have to go to Raymond's house as well. Mm, what should we do first? Should we go to Raymond's... Oh, do you know what? Let's go to Kalkstein first. Let's go to Kalkstein first. Kalkstein's house. Right, okay. I'll see you guys at Kalkstein and let's confront the little bugger. It's a shame, really, so I quite like Kalkstein. I suspected you were working with Javed. You think I lead Salamandra? I'll die laughing! Um, I'm certain you don't fool me with your scholarly guys. Do you think it is him? Are we are we making a mistake here? I'm certain. You don't fool me with your scholarly guys. You're a fool, Geralt. Hmm. So, I should keep an eye on him. So I think what we need to do now is go and see Raymond and talk to him what we know. The detective. Yes, I'll see you there. I have the autopsy results. And? I'm certain it was Kalkstein. How do you know? The liver was cirrhotic. The stab wounds were just a clumsy attempt to hide the real reason. So, poison after all. But how can you be sure it was Kalkstein? Changes in the eyeballs, typical of alchemical poisons. 
I see you did your homework. I sure did. Come back later. I need to analyze this information. See, maybe there's another um, alchemist somewhere. Okay, so we need some time. So we got a bit of time to do something else now. Possibly. I have a message for you from Yevin. Yevin? I don't need to read it. I know what he wants. Witcher know that whether elf, human or dwarf, they all want the same thing. She dwarfs. <laughs> uh, gold? Gold. Gold indeed. If you care to drop by later, you can collect my answer to Yevin. Agreed. But don't count on getting any gold from me. Yevin has doubtless promised you some already. All right, well, time to return to Vivaldi later to receive the reply. So it's another one we have to wait upon now. All right, so whilst we're waiting for things to progress, we could jump back onto this one again, the century. So I need to find a craftsman who will make this lightning rod for me. And it's pinpointing over here, armor of the order. So let's pop over there. It's only just up here. I'm not sure how long I have to wait for these other quests to go progress forward, but um, and a lot of the secondary quests as well are kind of halted for now. So armor or right, those doesn't cost much. Need anything? Yeah, a lightning rod. Can you make a lightning rod? For What's cheap? that? A long metal rod. Should have said, but no, I'm a swordsmith and devote my time to the order. What if I give you a donation to the order? Say, 70 orans? Very well. Come back later. I can't start just now. <laughs> There's a lot of come back later. Quest update this entry. I must bring... I must bring 70 orans to the armorer. I thought I just did. Come back later. All right. We can't do that for yet either for now. I wonder if I should, um, like, sleep or something. Or meditate, shall I say. Hmm... Well, do you know what? I'm going to spend a bit of time just um, having a wander around, basically. I might go and speak to the Gravedigger again, if he's up here. And, I don't know. See, if I make sure I haven't I haven't missed anything out, I guess. And hopefully, by doing this, other quests will kind of re-engage, maybe. I could see Shani. I might go pop over to see Shani as well. So, right, the Gravedigger's just up here. And hopefully, we want to be able to get into the cemetery gate... I think it was locked. Unless it's unlocked now. No, it's still locked. What do you need? You seem to know a lot about the deaths in the city. Oh, hang on. You seem to know a lot about the deaths in the city. Ever help with investigations? Sometimes I inform Raymond about the more interesting dead men. I don't trust Raymond. He's hiding something. Maybe you can tell me too. No, I promise to keep quiet. I see. Who buy? What do you need? Um, can we give you some more liquor, maybe? Some meat? Kidding. What do you need? I can't remember what we gave him last time, to be fair. But we need to, we need his tongue to talk, <laughs> don't we? Nothing like hooch. a good drink. He likes hooch. Right. Yo ho ho and a bottle of rum. You're not likely to tell me anything interesting. What do you need? You seem to know a lot about the deaths in the city. Ever help with investigations? Sometimes I inform Raymond. Well, we've done this bit. Um, let's try this one. I don't trust Raymond. He's hiding something. Raymond? You wouldn't find a more loyal man. He seems to be struggling with this case. I should help. Will you let me inside the cemetery? City authorities prohibited it. How I can I change your mind? I'll just give you I some rum. Captain Mice's permission. No other way to sway you? Actually, I have a terrible debt with Taller. Clear those debts, the cemetery key's yours. Okay, let's do that then. Um, okay, farewell. Farewell. Okay, we're getting somewhere now. Um, new quest, a grave digger's gratitude. So I need a permit to enter the cemetery. Thaler or the city guards should provide me with one. So we need to clear his debts. Okay, let's do that then. Right, so Thaler is that fence we saw a couple of those episodes ago. So, uh, yes, let's go and see uh, Thaler the fence. Can you get me inside the cemetery? I could do anything, but I don't feel like it. How can I convince you? 
This damn investigation is getting tiring. Prove me innocent. Prove him innocent. All right, we've had a couple of drinks. Nothing's really changed. We're very drunk. I ran out of drink, basically. So I'm not sure what to do now, really, regarding um, going forward. So I need to I need a permit to enter the cemetery. Thaler or the city guards. So let's see. Okay, let's see the city guards then. So we could go and talk to that um, drug addict, Jethro, again and see what he says. Hopefully he'll get us, uh, get us in the cemetery. <laughs> No, nothing. Can we give him some fist tech? Have we got any left? I never turn down good fist tech. Oh, no, you don't. So we can't do anything with him. So we could do the head of the city guard guy. The we got his name. Um, let's do that. Let's do this up here. And what's his name? Is he here? Vincent Mize. That's his name. What is it, Witcher? Here we go. Can you get me a pass into the cemetery? No trouble. Maybe you can clean it up while you're there. I'll see. Okay, do we get a pass? Okay, now we should have just gone straight to him. So let's go back to the grave digger then. And uh, have a look in the cemetery. Excellent stuff. But I've not seen him. Perhaps he's recovered. Oh, I wish. Who's this woman? Worry no further. Easier said than done. Zolstock. I can't talk to her. Oh, I can. <gasps> oh, woe is me. Will no one help me? I've never Why seen it before. Grief? My husband haunts me. What do I do? Haunts you in your bedchamber? My late husband haunts me. Um, yeah, so long. Tell me more. Maybe I can help. My husband died a month since, and now haunts me in my home, wailing nightly. But the worst thing is he... I'm listening. Worst, he flies around the cemetery at night, shouting lies about me. Well, no one can Doubtless, hear. tongues are wagging already. Set him straight, I beg you. Okay. It will cost you 200 orins if I succeed. Oh, that's a hefty sum. Profiting off someone else's misery. Well, deal with him and I'll pay. Where will I find you when I'm done? I'm here every day at noon. Why can't I collect payment when I want? Are you daft? My husband flies around ruining my reputation. I'll not be seen in the company of a killer. So long. All right, so she's only here around noon. New quest, a restless ghost. I have to go near the cemetery at midnight. All right, it's to be fun. But let's talk to him anyway. What do you need? I'll, I'll the key, please. I want to get inside the cemetery. City authorities prohibited it. I have a pass from Captain Mice. Here are the keys. Go inside where we lay the fresh ones. But if they kill you, don't return to haunt me. Okay, farewell. Farewell. Excellent. So we can have a little look around. I should take a look around the crypt in the cemetery. I can enter the cemetery now. All right, let's quickly save it. Let's have a look, wander in. We need to come back anyway at midnight to get rid of this ghost of that, that woman. Um, but yes, we've opened up another little area here. Vizima's Cemetery. All right, shall I have my, shall I have my silver sword out ready? And shall I put some poison stuff on it? Right, I've only got one uh, spectral here, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh, well, I need to make some more, really. So I'm not gonna play it now. So, Thug's Corpse, Crow's Eye. What the hell? It's quite a big, it's a big old area, isn't it, actually? Okay, get all the auras we need, get everything. Right. Crow's eye. Oh, these are like um, herbs then. Okay, I'll, I'll do all that off camera. Uh, let's go over here because I saw... I don't know. What did I see? A relief. What the hell is that? Thug's corpse. <gasps> I'll go. Oh, we need an Al Gol. We need an Hang on a second. One second, Al Gol. Um, I did actually have a quest for Algol something or other. The Algol contract. 
Kalkstein will pay cash for the marrow of three Algors. Oh, brilliant. Okay, just so I know what I'm dealing with here, these Algors, they are sensitive to silver and they need a strong style. Well, it's most effective. So strong style uh, silver. Excellent stuff. All right, let's keep going. This is nice. Right, okay, it's one dead. Just need the marrow. Brilliant. And we have some marrow. And some white wine, uh, some uh, not white wine vinegar, but some vinegar. All right, let's kind of look at this thug. Oh, there's a crypt the entrance down there. Oh, man, this is so much to see here. So, was this the guy? This wasn't the guy we did the autopsy on, was it? White rose, ham sandwich, as you do, and some orange. Right. Okay, I'm going to keep walking around here for a bit. I'm going to see what this relief is. And obviously, in the me hopefully, in the meantime, we're going to get... So what do you put in there then? The relief, I wonder. Hmm. All right, so I'm going to go into the crypt then, I think. Yeah, let's go in the crypt. Have a little wander. Oh, something's come up. Oh, we're drained dead. Sod him. <laughs> Sod that. Oh, right. I'm going to put my cat potion on. And now we can see beautifully. Right, I better save it because I think it's going to be difficult in here. Oh, just a normal goal. These are, these are quite old, uh, hard. Well, not really. All right. Let's go loot him. Um, Let's go through there. Mangled corpse. So how big is this place? I need algals, not um, these things. Right, he goes that way. Oh, I can blow that hole. I reckon I can blow that down. There's a mangled corpse here. Mangled corpse. Oh, these aren't anything special. They're just normal. Okay. Oh, God's sake. All right, I'm just going to kill him in a sec and we'll decide where we want to go. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Another mangled corpse here. And he's got some chicken on him. <laughs> oh my god. Too many of these things. Oh, do they, quite, they are quite easy. I'm hardly... I'm not losing any health whatsoever. Oh my god, this place is absolutely huge. <laughs> this place is huge. I could get some nice... I could get some nice bit of... um XP here, though. I would say. Oh, there's nothing around here. Um, let's let's keep going this way. I might go back, backtrack, and go to the start. So I might see if I can blow a hole in here. Oh, it's a gravier. What, what's a gravier? Right, hard side. Right, here we go then. Okay, we might be in trouble now because there's a few. There's a few here. I think the gravius are really hard, from what I remember. But I'm going to save here. This is this is a bit where. Oh, this could be difficult now. Let's put group style on. Christ! Oh my God! What's this? Right, let's go get my Igni. Okay, this might be difficult. <laughs> Come on, just I'll try to get a fire on him. Come on. Okay, I think I'm doing it. I'm going to survive. I think maybe I should just use R. I think R is probably more effective. This is the big obese this is. 
Oh, he's still there. Let me just get this Fledger. Well, this guy's health is not going down. Come on. Come on. Shit, 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 shit. This is not good. Well, I'm gonna have to have a different potion now. Because I'm getting I'm getting wrecked here. My health is really, really low. I might have to the uh which one is it? Endurance. I might I may have some of that. Oh, I think I should have as well. I should have I should have done this one, shouldn't I? Protective shield. Right, what I might do is just I might just cast this Quen. <laughs> Right, I can stay in there for a bit. Oh, good, that didn't last very long, did it? I'm in trouble, I think, guys. Um, I don't know what to do here. Right, I might put Blizzard on, actually. I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Look at my health now. Oh my god, I'm gonna put the, I'm trying to put the I'm trying to put the, the shield on. Shit. I'm just trying to back away, back away, back away. Just when my health regenerates. Well, I might put some blade... Blade coating on. I might just do this, actually. Come on! <laughs> Oh, we got it. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Right, let's go and use my Ard again. Not my Ard, my shield. That's all I can do, just run away like a little girl. <laughs> right. Is there anything we can actually eat to get our, get our thing up? Have a, ham, have a bit of chicken. Eat it slowly. This is dangerous. Oh, he's... Oh, shit. He stunned me. <gasps> Fuck. Piss off. This is bad. This is bad. Hard sign. It's the best sign. Kill him in one hit. Hard. Hard is brilliant. It's by, it's by far the best sign. By far the best sign. Oh my god. Right. Uh, that's what these dudes have got. Let's wait for the, uh, the stuff to wear off. My god. Hard is brilliant. So he's got a gravier bone. Probably useful for something. I've got another fang here. So, let's have a look at this. Oh, Ray Raymond's corpse? What the hell? Let's get rid of this bloody slow motion first. Okay, well, I can just use this white honey. Right. So, character. Quest updated. Vivaldi. Right, so let's see what he's got. Diamond dust. Weapon upgrade. 
Wow, that's a real good weapon upgrade as well. And we got a silver ruby uh, ring here. Very probably a real good value ball expect. Um, okay, we've got a load of XP on that one. Let's see what update has has happened then. Crazy, what is he? What's he doing here? So I found Raymond's body. Azar must have killed and impersonated him. How could I have fallen for this illusion? I have to tell the grave digger about this. After all, it's his cemetery. I, I also should return his key. So the Raymond we were talking to was an illusion. That was crazy. Okay, so I've just seen this as well. So the evidence suggests that Thaler is innocent. I should speak with him. I'll tell Thaler I have proof of his innocence. And then the evidence suggests Vivaldi is innocent. I should speak to him and tell him of his innocence. Wow. Okay. I can't believe all these other quests were kind of waiting for this. For the, for the whereabouts of Raymond. Right. Okay. I'll, I'm going to still look for the grave anyway. Um, I need to put another cat's eye on, which is annoying. I, I cancelled everything. Right. It's too dark. I can't look in there. I'm going to have to, I'm going to, have to come out and come back in later on. I think for now, let's go and speak to the grave digger. Um... Yeah, speak to the grave digger. I might spend some time as well off camera killing these algals to get the marrow. Yeah, there's a lot to do in here. And I gotta make some more cat potions as well. What do you need? Oh no, it's not given the key yet. No, no. Farewell. I don't want to give him the key yet, because I want to go back in there. Um, but for now. I'm going to make some cat potion off camera and I'm going to leave that video there. It's probably going to be a long one. Ashes. ashes to ashes, yeah. All right, guys, hope you've enjoyed it and hopefully I'll see you on the next episode. Until then, take care.